Spotlight. Episode in the channel Spotlight and review series today. We're here with Neat MC. Let's play some Minecraft. So basically, before this episode even starts, I want to just I'll update this at the end again. But as of now, which is February third, I do not have any more channel spotlights in my application bar. So everybody who entered has got theirs. If you entered and you didn't get one, that's probably because your channel has been discontinued or I couldn't find the channel. Because if you change your channel name, it doesn't sometimes it doesn't link up. Some of them do, but some of them don't. So if you change your channel and you didn't get in, the link is always down in the description below to join the series. And if you're new to seeing this, you can get your own channel spotlight and review. So let's kick off today's channel spotlight with the logo. And the only thing, the logo is interesting, but I would do is like add your name like neat in here. Like add like that kind of graphics into there. Because then people have an idea of like this is their name and it's showy, it's artistic, and it's eye catching. So that's the first thing people look at. It's like not your name, but they look at your profile picture to be it eye catching. And your background is really good. I like the background. This is, it's, that's okay. I wouldn't personally put that in there just because it like shades over some of the area but this is a nice background well edited even if you made it yourself or someone else you made it, if someone else made it for you maybe you could put like a little tag down here always to give you your credits but anyways that is pretty good so another thing that I would do is I personally like just adding a channel intro in here the first thing that plays because once someone goes on your channel that's unsubscribed it will automatically start playing to them so it's like catchy and add like some kind of cool stuff to catch their attention in. Like right now they're just seeing a bunch of text and pictures and movies. So if you have that on there it'll automatically play and maybe it'll just be able to catch them before they start criticizing anything else in the channel because they might like they might not like one thing like, Oh, I don't like so something here and then they catch the video, it's like, Oh, this is actually not that bad, maybe we should stick around. So that's what I would do in that Um, that's about it on this page. So let's go into the videos page. And it looks like there's a good bit. Yeah, it looks like there's a lot of thumbnails. The thumbnails, once again, are appealing, especially to me, because I like to see the pictures of it. Like, I can tell this is going to be Brain Freeze, Episode 5, rather than having to read the whole text down at the bottom. So it's like eye-catching, there's color, it's easy to read, it's... Like you could be, it's probably your own, and it's awesome. So it's also a creative site. You can be creative. D Studio. But we'll check out LOTR. Oh man, oh man, it's time for a nostalgia trip back in time. Lord of the Rings, the battle. Sign it was. That was a cool intro to add in there. Something to like show off your series yourself. It's a cool intro, so I like I like having catch intro. Also, we'll check out the other warning. The others do not do anything here. But yeah, we're gonna start with pillars and such. So we're gonna try to make the best of it. And I've got some stuff here ready. Got some cobblestone smelting for smooth stone, so we can get to work. Graphic quality is good. Audio is clear, perfection. And then now to the very end of the episode, if there is even. <laughs> I'm standing here. I'm standing here. You yeah, I know. You're, <laughs> you're right clicking with your sword. There, there you go. go. Don't get knocked back in. Ah, <laughs> don't do that. What I would do is add in an outro to that. It's outros are always like a final thing. The plus we can do with outros is, if you haven't known this, you can attach other videos to them. You can add your tag. So basically, there's a option where you go into the video editor on YouTube, so you can create a box or a caption, and say, click here for episode number three, or it'll go to different episodes or go to different things, or you could actually add a subscribe button onto it too. So those are always good to add in at the very end, so you can grab more attention to other videos. And also grab subscribes right then and there. So let's go check out the playlists. And there's a lot of playlists in here, which is perfect. I like playlists so much because I personally hate going into YouTube channels 
and then there's just a whole list of videos not to go through like like there's 117 videos I don't want to go through 117 videos to find one video that I like and then to find the rest of the series so I wanted to find the three of Skyblock Road I have to go through my 117 videos to find three so that's why they are important now the channel page also the featured channels are good to have they'll show you like yeah these are the people I like to play with or I follow and they're my friends and go check out them too what I would also add down here is like famous youtubers that you watch so then people can get an idea of like this is the person I like to watch and then this and this 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 so yeah now to the about tab um, nicely spaced out I like that because I hate having to read when the text is like one big paragraph straight down the page and nice spaced out there's a good bit of depth um, you could maybe add a little bit more info about what you do and what you record with and show off your your abilities like this is what my channel is this is what it's going to be this is my story this is my life this is what I use all this kind of stuff maybe add some more social media tabs I haven't seen okay, there's no social media tabs social media tabs are important so people can connect to your Facebook your Google your Twitter your LinkedIn your Instagram your twitch anything so people can go to them and they can get more followers on there and then the followers from there can go back to there and it adds it builds it builds up in the follower and subscriber fan base and it can't hurt to put it on so why don't do it if you have it put it on because this is basically your page this is your story when I see this I see this is me MC so that's all I got for the spotlight number 13 today and I'm going to end off with the subscribe like I do to everybody's channel and hopefully meet you can come and check out my channel as well so thanks guys for watching hope you all enjoyed if you did please remember to leave a like it'd be greatly appreciated comment down below if you have any suggestions for me for my series or for neat on his channel what he can do to make it better go subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and subscribe to these two and like I said before this is the last one I have in my block if yours wasn't played for some reason or you haven't added you haven't submitted one yet please go into the links down below and fill out the quick form which will only take a couple minutes and then it will go to my Google Drive page and then I can pick it up and then I'll make the paper and then boom you can get one of these just for yourself and you get a free subscriber along the way too and active viewers because I if you haven't known I do go around and watch some of the videos because some of the people I meet on here it's like they have like only like 60 subscribers but I go and watch some of the videos and they're really funny and they're really good so I go through and watch a bunch of different types of videos on these channels so don't think I don't so that's that's an important plug too just not to subscribe because I ha hate having active or non-active subscribers to press the subscribe button and never watch it again it's like it's not gonna do anything like you get you get you have like there's people that I see with thousands of subscribers yet they get a hundred views per episode you look at the ratio a hundred over two thousand like how many people are actually not watching your content so it's not like a really true number so and there are some good videos on here there's a lot of views I'm seeing around here good bits so that's all I got for you guys today I'll stop blabbling blah 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 and I'll see you guys if there is another entry, or I'll see you back in my regular videos.